Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'll be unboxing my owl crate for the month of July. So yeah, let's go ahead and unbox this. So here's what it looks like on the inside. So this month's theme was a Break the Curse, as you can see there. And this is just a spoiler card on the back there. So let's go ahead and grab our first item here, which I'm seeing is this purple box. I think these are highlighters, um, which is interesting. So, yes, yeah, this is, so they are highlighters. So I'm gonna go ahead and open these up. So it looks like we get a pack of three and this won't open. Okay, so we have a pack of three pretty cheap highlighters. Um, so yeah, but they all have quotes on them. So on the pink one, it says, find the light that makes your lantern shine. And on the purple one, it says, after all, every story has a, every story has a story, okay? And then on the blue one, it says, love and madness are two stars in the same sky. So I like two of these quotes. I really don't, you know, whatever. So these are double-ended. Um, on the top, it's just like a skinny marker. And then on the top bottom, it's like a flat end or something. Um, these are nice, but very cheap item, um, and I already have highlighters, so, but these are so nice. I like the colors of them at least. Alright, the next thing I'm seeing is this little thing. I think this is just like a reusable bag, um, it look like, and you could like fold it back in itself and like travel with you. Let me go ahead, let me go ahead and grab it out of here but yeah it's just one of those tote bags that you bring with you and you can like put it back into itself so here's the bag it is very pretty but i just don't like these type of bags um i just don't like the material but you know that's just me and also the design i mean design is very pretty but I just don't think I will get any use out of it. So, yeah. But that is inspired by House Moving Castle. So, yeah. All right, let's see what the next item is. Okay, so the next item is one of the notebooks that they're doing this year. I'm gonna go ahead and open it. So, here is the notebook for this month. It's very pretty. I love the folding. So it says how to live forever with some nice rose gold folding on it. And on the back here, very pretty. So it says what is a person if not the marks they leave behind? And then of course you have the notebook, but these are like the ones that you can, um, once you fill out this notebook, you can take it out and put a new one in, which I like. I think that's really, really cool. Um, so I do love it. And this seems to be inspired by the life of Ari LaRue. So yeah, I like these journals that they've been doing. Very pretty, so I do love those. All right, and then the next item is another box here. Here it is, and this is an item inspired by Valid Made of Thorns. And this is a sun catcher, so that seems really, really cool. I'm gonna go ahead and get that out inside this little package as well. So let's see. I like some catchers, so I'm very excited to see how this one looks. And of course, it's hard to open. Here, there we go. So it's a very small sun catcher, but it's very, very pretty. If I can untangle it. Okay, there we go. So here it is. Hopefully, you guys can see it well. Oops. So we have a, okay, I'm trying to untangle this. Oh no. All right. So we have a sun, a moon, and then like the crystal. So I do love this. This is a very nice item. And the last item I think is our treasure tones in our pen that they've been doing this year. So let's go ahead and open yes. it. This is probably my favorite, maybe. Um, this is inspired by Spinning Silver which is very nice. And this is designed by No One Design. Very, very pretty. I love it so much. 
and on the inside it says in the mirror I had become a queen in the dark forest maybe of ice and a dark for um in a dark for forest made of ice sorry um but yeah it's very pretty I love this one a lot and I think that's all the items and then we have the book at the bottom yeah yeah so this one's book is garden of the curse so let's go ahead and open this bad boy up so i am very tempted to cancel our crate um but yeah i think i'm gonna cancel at the end of the year i don't think i'm gonna get it next year just because um i haven't been loving their redesign covers as of late um like, I'm not really a fan of this redes redesign cover. I just don't like it. Um, I know a lot of people will love this, but it's just not my type of style that I prefer. Um, but you know, that's just me. And then we have this binder, and then the back. Um, we have purple sprayed edges on all sides, which is really nice. I'm really glad that they're doing more sprayed edges, at least. But it's just not worth keeping. So that's something I'm canceling at the end of the year just because I also do want to keep, uh, complete my collection of the treasure tomes because I love them and I have every single one so far so like I might as well just get all of them for the rest of this year um so yeah but yeah I'm just not redesigned I'm just not a fan of this redesign cover um so let's go ahead and take off the dust jacket they do have reversible artwork on the dust jacket here but again um it's really pretty, but I really wish they made them usable reversal dust jacket. Like, I wish they would put the title on the spine and the cover. Like, I feel like that would be much better, but whatever, I guess. And then we have the naked hardback with some nice rose gold foiling, which is very, very pretty. We have the spine there and then the back. Um, and it says, I fear if I'm not careful, you will steal my heart too. The Ballad of the Moon Thief. So that's very pretty. I love the back. The front is also very pretty. We have some... Um, oh, he's making a hand. Um, but yeah, anyways. We have the end paperwork right there. Artwork. And then on the back, they are different. So I do love that. Very, very pretty. So I like that a bit. So... Yeah. And we do have an inbound author letter and it's also signed by the author which i do love very very pretty um so yeah, i'm happy with that but yeah that's everything in the july box of our crate um overall i'm okay with it um i like the item the only thing that i really don't care for is the highlighters because look this is a very cheap item oh and the reversible bowl bag thing i just don't like it um but yeah everything else is pretty good um i just don't like the cover of this one it's pretty simple um it's fine i like the spray edges the purple is very pretty the art um the end papers are very nice the foiling on the naked heart bag is also nice so yeah but i don't know i'm just not a fan of this type of cover that they've been doing um but yeah like, I prefer character artwork on the covers, which I know people don't, but I do. Um, and I feel like they've been doing a lot of not not enough of that lately. So, that's what I'm thinking of canceling. Um, so, yeah. But anyways, uh, let me know your thoughts of the bug and on the items. Make sure to like, comment below, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next unboxing video. Bye, guys.